Alright guys, uh, don't really like doing unboxing videos because I like to see what's in the box or the condition of it, so I already take it out, but i um, just going to do a quick overview on some safety glasses, uh, ESS safety glasses in particular. Um, so let's go ahead and get this started. Alright, so got a 4th of July sale on uh, these um, at copesdistributing.net it's going to be a .net address um, it was part of their 4th of July sale and it is a pair of ESS ice safety glasses um, this is going to be a US unit issue um, say it on there but uh, it's good issue it's got the uh, NATO NS in there uh, Four two four zero zero one five two five five zero eight five, and it says NATO underneath it. Got a UPC on there, anyways. Um, I'll uh, show you what that would be on the uh, ESS ICE website. But anyways, this is going to be the unit issue kit. Um, we'll go ahead and take it out of the bag. All right, so we have it out of the bag. Um, it's gonna be the little ESS semi-rigid carrying case. It's the one with the belt loops on the back and the little carabiner clip. So you can clip it onto some molly, webbing, whatnot, and just kind of have it with you because you know it would look super cool carrying this around on your belt. Hey guys, just wearing my iPro on my belt because I could do that. It's got the features for it. But yeah, other than that, you know, I'll uh, just use the clip on there. So let's take a let's take this thing, and get it open, show you what all comes inside. All right, so we got it open. Uh, you could even feel on the outside. It feels like they have like some plastic on the lid and just kind of around the front of it. That's where you get that semi-rigid. Uh, case. So, kind of starting from the top, going from the bottom. With this unit kit, you get op drops, anti fog, and lens cleaner. It's got the uh, instructions on the side. Go ahead and set that there. Um, little uh, kind of an Oakley bag, ESS on there. So it's just going to be a kind of cleaning case, um, and then a storage bag just like the Oakley bags. Uh, let's see, what else? Little uh, straps to uh, clip into on the uh, earpieces. Uh, we have the ice frames with the clear lenses in there. Uh, we have the smoke gray lenses. They have a nose piece in it as well, but it is uh, in a bag. Let's see, what else? Got some swag, got an ESS sticker, and the ESS Ice Eye Shield User's Guide. Uh, prescription inserts available for this one, um, like most of the other goggles and uh, glasses that they have. Alright, so uh, with the user guide, um, just kind of shows you the limited warranty and repairs. Um, kind of a caution, don't fully trust these, but uh, you know, it has good protection kind of thing. And then uh, just some contact information, um, email, fax, phone, international, that. And then on the flip side, you have instructions on changing the lenses, uh, what you do on that, it's a step-by-step -step process and uh, clean, care and cleaning at the bottom so we'll close that put that off to the side along with the swaggy the ops drops all right all right on the uh, side of the ice uh, safety glasses you have uh, little notches in there to where you can pull your pieces out make them a little bit longer to fit the user and um, they also have wires in the earpieces to where you can bend them um, to kind of wrap around the ear if you don't want to do the whole straight look. So I um, have these on now. Um, as you can tell, they go up past the uh, brow line right here. 
um, and they do wrap around all the way to the side so you've got a pretty good uh, area of protection around your eyes um, they also talk about uh, ease free field of view um, I can really see a lot the only thing that's noticeable is the uh, nose piece and that's just a very faint uh, faint amount um, and then if I were to look up I can see the uh, two uh, two connection points to the frame but other than that if I'm looking straight forward uh, like anybody would really um, shooting position anything like that you can't really tell that you have uh, the glass over you all right and then we have the little uh, strap to uh, connect onto the pieces um, there's little holes on each side of the eye pro to where uh, this male part will uh, snap into all right I have those snapped in and um, it's a pretty secure fit um, you can adjust how much strap you want on the back And uh, wearing it now when it's not adjusted out of the box, I can feel the glasses kind of putting pressure on my face like they're uh, really pulling it close. But as you can tell on the back of that, you can, I mean, you can see that the strap's kind of on there and secure. All right, and uh, let's go ahead and try to do a transfer on the uh, lenses, see how easy that's going to be. So let me set the camera down and uh, we'll get to it. It always helps to have your handy dandy user's guide. Let's see. Remove each side of the frame by carefully prying the frame away from the lens. Do not attempt to remove by holding the temple section beyond the hinge. Alright. Let's see how hard this is going to be. So, they want you to like pinch it and kind of go up on it. Why does it have to be so hard? Ugh, okay, there's one. There's the other one. That was a little bit easier. Let's get these head strips uh, out of there. Okay. So we'll go ahead and install them. Align the lens grooves with the corresponding temples and squeeze until they snap into place. So... Okay, heard that snap down. Let's go with the other one. It's not really a snap, you can just hear them fitting in there, but... It's whatevs. Alright. Kind of get the fingerprints and the sticky fingers off that. All right. Let's put this one on, see how it looks. All right, now I have the smoke gray lenses on. I actually like these a lot. It kind of gives you that good sunglasses. Uh, tint to it um, yeah those are really nice so I could see why they have the clear and the smoke gray ones um, you could change between indoor with the clear and then anything outdoor really with the smoke gray lenses I like them and you're thinking too um, you know with iPro when it comes to shooting you gotta think about ear pro so how do these uh accommodate or how do these complement ear pro how do they fit what is that so anyways i have my impact sports uh electronic earmuffs so i'm going to put these on with the glasses and see if uh it's going to be uncomfortable or not so anyways i got my ear pro on now um i still have a pretty good solid uh solid uh suction or good surface area around uh, the area of the ear. Usually when you have uh, iPro or anything on like that, it'll kind of 
interfere with that so you can hear some sound and stuff well anyways um kind of rides on the top part of it so it's above the ear um i know ess has their suppressor it's got a thinner frame or an earpiece to where uh you won't have that problem but with the ice it's pretty thin too so uh i'm not having any problems with that you just have to have your uh eye pro settled in uh get your ear pro settled in towards all just kind of fitting um because it will kind of control the way that the frame's moving around if you're moving your ear pro so overall this is a really good buy like i said i got it at copesdistributing.net um it was for their fourth of july sale um, this is when I got it in the mail uh, today, but whenever I uh, paid for it, it was only $20, and shipping was free. So $20 for a unit kit, this is all new. I mean, there wasn't any scratches or anything, as you could tell with the smoke gray ones. They're already in the plastic still, and you got your stickers and swag. So this is brand new. I mean, this is surplus brand new just twenty dollars uh... what i am going to do though is on ess's uh... website they're out of stock but i also have another place where they always have great prices um, it's always below msrp and they do have it in stock um, it's called entry gear uh... they do have a section for ess and they do have the uh... Spare frames and a nose piece set. I think it's like, uh, I know it's over 10, less than $20 uh, for the replacement. And they also have replacement lenses or extra lenses. Um, I am going to get the high def yellow. I know ESS offers it as the uh, ICE 3LS uh, set, the three lens set. Uh, on their website, though, that's eighty dollars. I want to see on Entry Gear, it's about seventy-five or so. Um, the replacement lens is about fifteen dollars. So with you know all this for twenty dollars, um, spare frames for I don't know, like let's just say fifteen dollars, and then uh, extra lens for about sixteen, let's say fifteen dollars. I mean you're saving a lot I mean you're you're get you're ahead of the game I mean you're saving a lot more than you know just buying the 3LS set um, pretty content with the case though I do know that they have cases where they have like individual slots for each set of glasses I may get that in the future if I really want to if not I mean I could just put everything in the case maybe get an extra Oakley bag for each lens who knows but I'm um, Highly satisfied with these ESS glasses, the ice glasses. Picked them up, good deal. Copesdistributing.net. Check them out. I'll post all the links uh, in the comments section or the area below. So you might want to check this out. Possible goodbye. But that's just me. Anyways, guys, Plex out.